Good day everyone, my name is Blessime C. Uwabe, a medical technology intern from San Pablo College's Medical Center. So in this video, I'm going to show you the microbiological procedure for the stool culture and sensitivity. So to proceed, stool culture is a test that detects and identifies the bacteria that causes the infections of the digestive tract. For the materials needed, we're going to use the materials shown on the screen. Then for the patient identification, check the request form and check the specimen whether it is acceptable or not. Fill in the general bacteriology and urine and stool logbooks. And then gather all the materials and label the media by writing the date of collection, control number, number of hours of incubation, and the specimen to be tested. And now for the main procedure, always observe a septic technique by flaming the loop hot red. Then let it cool down before streaking the media. Then get the specimen cup then dip and moisten the loop with stool. Choose portion especially the mucoid or bloody areas. Then roll the loop on all the plates for the MAC, SSA, and the TCBS agar. For the stool culture, we're going to use the streak plate method of isolation. Here, we're going to streak the first quadrant. And then a septic technique. You can also turn the plate for easier streaking of the next quadrant. And then we're going to streak the second quadrant. And then after doing the aseptic technique, we will again turn and streak the third quadrant. Then for the last or the fourth quadrant, we will turn and streak by touching the third quadrant once only. Then we'll just have to repeat the steps for both SSA or Salmonella Shigella agar and the TCBS or Thiosulfate Citrate Bile Salt Sucrose agar. So in stool culture, we're going to use three types of agar. The first one is the MAC or the Maconkey Agar Medium. The Maconkey Agar Medium is used for selective isolation and identification of the members of family Enteriobacteriaceae, followed by the Salmonella Shigella Agar or the SSA. It is a selective and differential medium for the isolation of Salmonella and Shigella. And the last one is the TCBS or Thiosulfate Citrate Bile Sucrose Agar, which is a selective differential medium for isolating and cultivating Vibrio cholerae and other Vibrio species. And now for the tube media, open the specimen cup and touch and moisten the loop with the sample. And then emulsify the sample with APW, only the loop must be dipped in the tube media. Followed by the selenite F, again emulsify, and APW should always be done first since selenite F is toxic to alkaline peptone water. And after plating all the medias, we'll now proceed to the incubation. Incubate the media using ambient air incubator for 48 hours. Then always remember that plates should be facing downwards, like this one. Then after 48 hours of incubation, we will now report the results. Write the results and attach the workup form to the patient's request slip. Then after the procedure, observe proper disposal of plated media and other infectious waste. If disposable loops are used, it must be thrown in a bottle with hypochlorite solution. Thank you so much for watching!